So we have a theme for Scipio, like sort of Barbosa, sort of Scipio, but mostly everyone. Yeah. Because like we're sort of figuring out like how the book is working and like what's really happening. Because like it's sort of confusing if you don't really know what's going on. So, so we're gonna talk about how uh, so one of the characters takes the jobs of yeah. Barbosa. So like Barbosa has a customer that wants to steal something. So um, Riccio and Prosper when they came and got uh, the money for the stolen stuff that Scipio's sells, um, they got the they get the money and Barbosa asks, hey, by any chance does the thief lord like want a job for this customer? He said he wants something. So, uh, so basically, um, this is kind of a, this is a book where you really have to pay attention. It sort of reminds me of the movie Inception. Because you just really have to pay attention, and this might be spoilers if you haven't seen it. Yeah, and also, if you, like, think, like, if you would expect someone to, like, take a job, like, the thief or, like, that's a risk. That's, a, yeah. that's not, like, the right person to pick, because he's, like, sneaky. He's, like, a guy that's just, like, not kind of, like, he's not really a will be right for the job. Yeah. Because, I think, because Barboza uh, gives stuff, this is really again to another movie called Star Wars The Force Awakens. Um, it sort of reminds me of the dude at um, Jack U where he was like selling like the food portions. Yeah, And he right. was selling really bad prices. He, yeah, that's sort of how Barbosa is. Yeah, he's, he's like a, that dude. He, I, don't even th he, I don't think he has a name, but basically he's pretty cheap and like he sort of jips you out because you know he knows and you know that like this is sort of the only place where you're gonna get anything so he's sort of gonna jip you but you sort of have to take it because but, yeah i i'm like i probably agree and disagree because if the, like if the thief lord is going to the shop he already like steals stuff in here so like if he works here, he's probably just gonna steal more. Yeah, I'm thinking he's gonna just I might steal less if Marbos is watching. Because now he knows that uh, he's supposed Scipio is supposed to meet like a guy in private at one of the more like fancy hotels or something, and apparently this guy like wants it pretty bad. But like Barbosa could be like sort of like a spy too because like. Yeah, if he he's, might, uh, yeah, if he he might be an inside job. Yeah. He might have hired people to purchase. Maybe um, Victor is in like contact with Barbosa and maybe Barbosa is trying to hire him for a reason. Because I think in the book it said that they hated each other. Really. Barbosa and Victor? Uh, no, like Barbosa and my Scipio. Scipio. Yeah. Because we all know like that. Barbos is not really the nicest guy, so it's really hard to understand him as a character. Like, is he a nice guy or is he more of a bad guy? Yeah. So, but he's not doing anything like. Not doing anything. He's not like the main right now. But he's just like that nice. He's like the person who's like a not nice guy, but he's not a mean guy. Yeah, he's not a mean guy. He's like the one who's not really bad, like really caught hurting anybody, really. But he might come into like a good guy or a bad guy later in the book, so we don't know. So that was the theme for the Thief Lord and just everyone in the book.